This is going to be for my air signs, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, for your May 26th daily. Let's get started. Ooh, that flew right out. Queen of Fire. Nice. Aquarius, got the Queen of Fire. Come on, Libra and Gemini. Libra. Libra and Gemini. Gemini. Okay. So Aquarius, you guys have the Queen of Fire. And that is someone who is confident, warm, intelligent, and graceful. Or you're dealing with the fire sign as well. But this could also be your energy too. So it says, stretch your wings and fly. Don't underestimate yourself. Assert your independence and creativity. Ooh, so if for some reason you've been feeling a little under the weather, not too sure about how things are turning out for you and your projects and your creative anything um <clears throat> if you've been feeling a little insecure lately spirit is telling you that you be more confident in yourself believe in yourself you have that fire you have what it takes you you're underestimating yourself that's what it's doing it's telling you to to uh tackle and focus that side of your independence and your creativity it's telling you to stretch your wings and fly. You're ready to soar. It's just all about you changing your mindset. Knowing that you can do it. Okay? Whatever it could be. Projects. Work. Relationship. Take it as it resonates. Libra, you guys have renewal. The card of renewal. <clears throat> and this is Archangel Jeremiah. It says, review and evaluate. A favorable assessment of the facts. Time to move in a new direction. So if you've been looking at a situation or a family or people, friends, anything work, and you have been reevaluating it and you're feeling like you're not very happy with it or pleased or you know that it's not something you want to stay with or continue to do, Spirit is telling you that maybe you need to start something new. It's okay to leave it behind. There's nothing wrong with that. Just, it's if you're able to just drop it all and start new clean slate this is confirmation that you'll be okay to do that desire to go in a new direction exactly gemini you guys have the eight of water which is also the eight of cups wow it says a desire to move on the search for something more meaningful spiritual and emotional growth so if you've been feeling like you need to walk away from a certain situation, scenario, person, place, or thing, it's telling you to move on. You got to let them go. Let that situation go. Walk away. And there's something better for you. You need to, you need to freaking walk away from whatever doesn't serve you so you can allow the abundance and, and the creativity to come in and start something new and and just let the universe take over and let them bless you with abundance. But with you not walking away from certain things that are not good for you no more, it's like you're blocking your abundance and your your blessings from coming in. Because, because it's like telling the universe that you're not paying attention to their signs or not paying attention to um, the feelings that they've been giving you or any situation or the signs they've been giving you following your intuition it's like a slap to the universe's face because you're not listening to them so walk away from whatever person place or thing that's no longer serving you so that the universe can interview interfere and bring you your abundance and not block it anymore okay okay air signs this was your daily may 26 and i will see you guys mañana bye, -bye.